all right yes welcome welcome my people to yet again another video edition but this is an unusual video edition from my side and just a disclaimer from my point of view these coins here are not mine they have been sent to me by somebody down in nelson and another person from from new plymouth will be sending to me three coins of the same wedge tail ego colorized version he has been in shock and he is probably in fear that this might be fake no no it is not fake he just wants me to do a test on it and it will be being tested by a company in hamilton here that i live y gold so they have quite a robust machine that actually tests gold and, and silver that you put it through and then it scans and rectifies all the components of the um, composition and the percentage of composition in that precious metal so that's what i'll be doing once it comes in within the next week or so i should be able to do that for him and then send it back however for those of you who know about this particular coin itself it was issued by the power of mint and there were dealers authorized to sell this to the international market but what has happened is they have actually sent these coins to people without the box the box as well as the magnetic casing so this has got the senders of these coins worried that what has happened here so all i'm saying is nobody should panic the coins are legit it is not fake but there are only three dealers that i know of that actually issued this coin or let me say four I know LPM from Hong Kong, they are distributing these coins. MCM, which is your modern coin mart from the US, distributing this coin. Government from the US also distributing this coin, as well as I'm pretty sure AppMex would be also distributing these coins as well. But let me not speculate on AppMex, let me just stick to the three three of them that I know but eventually too because MCM and um, government are actually part of the same parent company so we'll say only only two two companies so what has happened is they have actually sent this to customers without the packaging without the box and people are complaining why are they paying 150 Australian dollars which was the price they paid according to what have been sent via email and then um, the retail price from Puff Mint was 95 Australian dollars it comes with a box and with the clamshell and everything um, I'm, I'm pretty sure that you guys would have seen that on this video or on this channel rather and what I am trying to say is <sighs> It is quite interesting because I have never come across this before. So because I do review things like this, you know, um, I do tend to get some emails from from people trying to find out what is happening. Because once they see my video, they see the box, they see the COA, they see how everything comes together. And then once they get theirs, they are saying that, oh, it's only coming like this what is the problem and they are paying and they are paying probably more than than the mint issued so yes 150 australian dollars compared to the 95 which the perf mint so that that is quite quite a difference saying that the international dealers don't give you the full package the box well i wouldn't call it a scam but it is 100 percent moving towards a scam type of um, transaction yeah you have actually scammed people out of the full full package it is original it is from the pavement but the question begs is are there three versions meaning is there a version that only comes in capsule and coa 1000 mintage the one with the box that i've showcased on this channel is that one 1000 mintage with the box as well 
and is there one that comes without coa or the one that says only boolean colored alone 1000 mintage so are there three versions making it 3000 instead of the 1000 there are questions to be asked there are questions that needs to be answered um why have dealers actually international dealers you know that have been entrusted to send out coins like this to to customers why haven't they delivered the full package expected by most people i mean in this case for me if i receive this like this i wouldn't be too too concerned i mean you guys know me on this channel like i don't really care about your packaging or your slabs or any of those things all i'm interested in is the coin itself but for some people this can actually make or break them up like this can actually make them 100 percent depressed and disgusted so the point is are we dealing with 3000 mintages here meaning 1000 with the box 1000 without box and coa and 1000 with only coin no coa well the dealers need to come up here and answer puff mint needs to come up here and give us some answers and explanation as to what has happened because this is more like short changing customers people that have actually paid more than the rrp which is your um, reserved retail price or something like that so i don't really understand why they have decided to do this to customers i mean the person who sent um this to me was actually quite quite furious so I believe he got 10 of them but he has d decided to send me five of them and another person is going to send me three for me to to verify so i don't know to, to be honest i don't really understand what has happened on here with um, dealers overseas lpm can come up here to answer mcm can come up here to uh, to answer uh, who else government can come up here to answer if AppMex was part of them they also need to come up here to actually answer on what has actually happened did the pavement not issue the box if pavement did issue the box to them then that is another question and that is another problem why did pavement issue the box to them and they haven't given it out to customers because i believe that dealers wouldn't hold back on boxes i mean what would they be doing with boxes i mean i don't know unless puff mint issued 1000 with the box to people and then 1000 without box and coa to international dealers as well as 1000 pieces without the coa to international dealers making it 3000 that is the only explanation that i can actually explain with regards to what have been sent so i don't know i don't know for me i am not too too concerned this is legit it is um original so don't be afraid to purchase from those dealers overseas if you are not too concerned about the box and the packaging all we are interested is the is the coin itself so all i can say is there are some questions that actually needs to be answered because it is unfair for people to pay 150 australian dollars and get no box and then people who paid 95 are actually getting the full package something is is wrong here there is um, a bit of a disconnect here so yes um it will be moving towards the area of fraudulent transaction or let me say fraudulent um sales more of um a scam like sales to to customers if you will charge them that high and not deliver the full package i will be expecting the price of this coin to be actually less maybe around 50 55 australian dollars thereabout but yes i'm a bit um surprised you know to have gotten an email and then um another request for me to be sent this coin so it is quite um quite interesting but it is moving towards that fraudulent behavior by international dealers and in as much as 
they did state on on their website because i had to go through some dealers website and some of them actually said with um coa only but yeah that is just a way to cover their backside you know just in case anybody start to sue them or something like that but um uh it has to be made very 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 clear in the in the um purchase segment of the dealers maybe they should have actually put in a box making an x on it with red does not come with box so that people will be aware but now nah, they will not do that they will rather scam you and get you to buy it but that is that is not a big deal but that's how they they operate in the realms of dishonesty in in as much as they want to sell so they won't really really go into that depth of detailing to tell you that it doesn't really come with um, a box but i feel for those who actually bought quite a lot hoping that it comes with a box but um it is what it is <laughs> it is what it is but yeah i i am feeling so sorry for them but um yeah the dealers need to come up here and and answer because yes it is going towards that fraudulent and scam like um sales to customers nonetheless purchase with confidence anywhere you see it box or without box no problem purchase it is one of the best coins so far and the first ever wedge tail color that we've seen so yes buy with confidence and all i can say is i hope i've spoken well i hope i've spoken with um with sincerity in in terms of analyzing what has happened so anyways all i can say is a very big thank you to each and every one of you i want to hear your comments in the comment section below if you are a dealer come on here and tell us what would have been the likely the likely um situation that would have caused this to to have happened or did pavement run out of um box manufacturers or something like that or were they not manufactured on time which i do not believe i will not buy that story i believe it's probably there are three thousand in circulation god knows but the secret or let me say anything that has been hidden any shady deal that has been done in in secret will definitely come out to life but anyways i have spoken well and a very big thank you to each and every single one of you for listening and i will need to start getting this ready to be sent back to nelson and once the dude sends his from new plymouth probably go to y gold here in in hamilton closer to kyodland's um kyodland's um suburb something like that and then get it um tested for them since everybody's on panic but at the end of the day have no fear it is legit a very big thank you to each and every single one of you yet again once again for listening and i will be sure to be waiting for you guys in the comment section to hear your take and your analysis and your opinion on what might have happened and with that i'll see you guys next time thank you very much for listening